Okay. We are recording. Okay, let's go ahead and jump in. I think some people are going to hop on late here, and that's totally fine. So we'll just get going. Okay. So our beautiful friend Deirdre is our is our uh, online or online guest, <laughs> our Zoom guest, special guest tonight. Um, so I just want to first off say that she's probably one of my favorite people ever. Like if you don't know <laughs> that, you need to know her because she's amazing. Um, and funny. So, so she was, um, a funny connection because she was friends actually with my cousin, um, in high school, I think. Right. Yep. And moved out to California. And then we actually ended up connecting on Instagram, oddly enough. And she became a loyal customer of mine and actually was like intrigued with this business because of, of all things, you're never going to hear this again, our, our, it's vital minerals is what got her addicted to it works. Like that's a first for me, I'll be honest, right? Usually it's like the greens or something, you know? No, it was the minerals. Um, so anyway, she has gotten going, gotten started and um, I am going to have her just tell you a little bit of how she works her business, how she kind of, um, gets going because I think like you all know me and you know how much I despise excuses and this girl has defied all odds and she makes it work. So, um, tell us a little bit of how your story, kind of how you got started and, um, just kind of how you work your business because I love that you don't have, um, the, uh, you, you don't have it easy. That's for sure. I mean, you, you actually have to like work a little bit harder, I think, than we all do. So tell us about that. Well, um, like just said, I started as a loyal customer. Um, I was, uh, intrigued by the, uh, <laughs> by the minerals. Like she said, um, Hey, don't hate. Okay. Cause it's, that's, <laughs> it's hard to find those. It's hard to find minerals like that. And if you're like me and you're into food and nutrition, like you realize that you don't get a lot of minerals that you need from food anymore. So most people don't care. I get it. I cared. I was nursing, so I cared and I wanted those. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I was a stay at home mom. Um, I had owned a bakery and a coffee shop previously to being a stay at home mom. Uh, after I had my daughter, I decided that I never wanted to leave her ever, never. Uh, and so, uh, her dad was like, stay home. I was like, okay. Um, and then about less than a month later than that, somebody offered to buy our bakery that we had for more money than we had paid for it. So we were like, it's yours, take it by. Um, so we bought a house in the desert. We were living at the beach in Huntington beach, California. We bought a house in the desert about two hours inland. Um, it, and it's not like, it's, it's the desert. Like it's like the wild, wild west, like for real up the mountain is where all the John Wayne movies were shot. Like seriously, like it's still a staged set and everything. You can go there seven days a week. Um, but I live up in a mountain in the desert and then in a Canyon and then up on a hill of like a really big hill, like a cliff. Um, so, uh, I, I started looking for part-time work to do from home. Um, I'm still bake and I still do uh, chef work from home um, or for events and stuff, but none of it is like regular by any means. Um, and so I started uh, looking at things I could do from home. And then Jess sent me a message was like, Hey, we're having this promo. Maybe you should think about distributing if you're using the products. And I was just like, Hmm, well, I'd never done sales before. Um, and then I got to thinking, uh, you know what? Dude, when I was like 16 years old, I got to work in the bar at TGI Fridays in Greenwood. That's right. And the bartenders told me that when I bust tables, if I could get their customers to get the drink special of the day for every drink I got, they'd give me a dollar on top of the tips. And I'm like, Psh, done. So I bust tables and anytime anyone sat down, I would go tell them about the drink specials. Me, 16 years old, telling them about the drink specials. Well, that first weekend I made like 60 extra bucks. And so literally I woke up in the middle of the night and was like, if I can sell drinks at 16, I can sell some vitamins. Okay. Okay. Let's do this. So I sent Jess like a, like an inspirational like picture. Like she said she could do it. So she did. She was like, Whoa! um, and so that's how I got started. Um, the thought of it, like you have to have Wi-Fi <laughs> and like friends and like a network. You have to have all that to do that. Never even crossed my mind ever. Never. I was like, okay, sure. Whatever. Um, so I guess my, my biggest struggle is that, um, you, you cannot, like, it's, it's not like we can't afford it or we don't get it. Like you 
cannot get Wi-Fi where I live. Like it is not an option. You can get dial up internet, like <laughs> dial up, but it doesn't load videos and stuff. So like, why would you get that? Right. Um, so no, I, I guess that's, I mean, kind of a downfall, I suppose, but, um, I just managed my time pretty well. And I either have to go up the mountain at some point or down the mountain at some point and I get Wi-Fi. Um, and actually in the small town that I live in, when I actually drive to town, I generally can't even make phone calls. So it's not like I can drive in my town to get internet. Um, and then I guess another thing that I guess maybe seems odd is that I wasn't on Facebook, like zero friends. I wasn't in social media, really. I had an Instagram, um, but that was like for posting pictures of the donuts that I made. Um, so I suppose that makes me kind of an oddball but whatever is not challenging is not really fun. Right. So, um, and she acts like I'm this like diamond, but I'm only an executive. I've been doing this for five months. Um, but my goal really is to help people. And I'm sure that a lot of people say that and they mean that and to each his own, but I generally mean that, um, I have a lot of knowledge and food and nutrition and holistic ways of life that kind of go hand in hand with the it works products considering that they're all plant-based and you know natural products um and i understand how they work so that's kind of why i wanted to share that with you um i don't have 70 customers yet and i don't have a huge team but every person that i have signed none of them have left after three months um they either try new products or they stick with the products that they're using um, because I have a system that I work with them and I genuinely care about their, their health and their wellness and like their results. And actually, um, and they're not even all, I actually, some of them are strangers. Some of them I met from social media, um, which is crazy to me because I thought that would take forever. I always hear them being like, well, I tried for a year to get this person. I tried for two years and I'm like, shit, girl, I don't have two years. Okay. I'm trying to get paid. Okay. Um, so I, I'm just really surprised that it's happening so quickly, but as you can probably tell from my candor, I'm pretty, I'm pretty real. Um, and I don't, <laughs> I don't have filters sometimes. Um, but I'm, I'm super genuine and I really want to help people. And I have, I have lots of success stories so far for my customers. Um, and for me, uh, with the minerals and like thermofit, especially for me when I couldn't get the rest of the baby weight off and it's like, I didn't have energy or maybe motivation or something. So, um, I guess if you think that you have struggles or you have complications or you don't have time or you don't have this or you don't have that, psh, I love it. Like it's I'm, just a matter of wanting it for sure. She, like literally had no network. Like she will have a conversation with me and have to drive down the mountain and it will be like spotty. And then it's like, be like, but it's okay. Cause I went to the cactus market today and I blitzed five people. Like, who are you? I love you. So I'm telling you what, like, I just love you so much let's get going let's hop in here. yeah all right so um okay so a couple things that we kind of jotted down because um people ask these a lot so let's just jump in here let's start with our newest product okay let's start with our new keto coffee okay let's talk keto coffee um you got it how do you a lot of people will say okay so if i'm not on a keto diet or if i'm not if you know i'm trying to to market the keto coffee, but not to people who are on the keto diet necessarily. Like, how do you incorporate that into people that are on non-keto foods, or they're trying to lose weight and they would like to incorporate that, but not necessarily do that kind of diet? What's your suggestion there? Um, okay, so uh, I uh, I don't know. If, okay, f first, there's gonna be like seven firsts to this whole thing right now. So like my first first a. If you haven't done the Dr. Don keto training, wherever it, I don't even know where it's listed. I like watched it, some random thing I saw. If you haven't done that, do it. Like, no joke, do it. Um, it took me like an hour and a half to watch it because I was watching it while I was at home at nighttime because I sometimes get internet at night. And I just kept like buffering and I'm like, come on, Dr. Don. Um, but it's totally worth it. And it will give you an overview of um, why it's called keto coffee. It has to deal with ketosis. And um, when you feed your body good fats and cholesterol, um, it then it you don't give it carbs. It then it goes to eat the fat away, basically, like in a nutshell. Um, so 
And secondly, um, if you're not familiar with the keto lifestyle, it's not just a diet. It's definitely a lifestyle. And it's not something that happens overnight. Your body has to get used to it. It has to like um, almost get like regulated to that style of eating. Um, so it's not like a fad. I mean, I suppose it could be. But people that are really into keto, it is a lifestyle for them. It will mess up your body if you keto two days, not keto. It's, it doesn't work that way. So most people that have a keto lifestyle, they're serious about it. Um, so I honestly, on Instagram, I, I've, I'm more of an Instagram person than a Facebook. I mean, I post on Facebook my five times a day um, and I get results. I get people from there, but mostly it's people that I grew up with and 75% of my friends are friends with Holly. So it's like, meh. Um, so that's a lose right there. We already know a distributor. Cool. I didn't know that when I became friends with Holly. So sorry. Um, so the keto, uh, the keto coffee, I, if you're on Instagram, people use hashtags way more on Instagram, definitely hashtag keto for sure. Cause you're going to get people that, uh, are interested in all things keto because it's become a lifestyle for them. Secondly, um, for me, anybody that I knew, anybody that I knew that worked out regularly, worked in a gym, uh, had somewhat of a healthy lifestyle. Um, has a busy lifestyle, talks about, um, you know, oh, I, I drink too much Diet Coke or I drink too much soda or whatever. Um, I told them about this because you don't have to have the keto lifestyle to enjoy this coffee. Um, if you in general have a healthy lifestyle or looking for a healthy lifestyle, this, this is a good way to do that. Um, it, in the, you know, in the long run, it will give you benefits of doing it. Um, so if you can get someone to sample it and then like the taste of it, and then initially everyone, I sent out 15 samples, everyone, everyone that tried it all said, oh my gosh, it gives me so much energy. I'm not jittery. I don't get like cramps from not eating. I feel full. I have lots of focus. Um, so them seeing that right off the bat will then get them to drink it. And then that will help them burn the calories and build muscle, which, um, you know, it's kind of, I kind of explain it to people in short that it's like, it's, it's like the collagen is like the best protein you can get. Generally it's made with animal products. So it tastes terrible. So this must be an odorless collagen that they're using. I mean, don't quote me on that. I don't know. I'm just guessing because collagen protein is, bleh, it's terrible, but it's hands down the best protein you can take for your body. Um, so this is like coffee and a, a protein shake kind of, I mean, I know there's not the amount of protein shake, but the amount of energy that it gives you and not just from the coffee, um, it, it's like taking a, a mini protein shake, I suppose. Uh, but then the cholesterol that you get from the grass fed butter, your brain has to have cholesterol to function. So um, it needs that. That's why you get so focused. And you're also feeding your body. Think about it. If you're eating like an avocado and coconut oil, with your coffee, you're going to get full from it. It just happens to be blended into the product. Um, so I just, like I said, I mean, I haven't really gone out. Like my mom wanted to try it. And maybe my mom's on this call. I don't even know. But my mom wanted to try it. And she's super particular about coffee and has to have 75 ounces of hazelnut creamer to 4.2 ounces of coffee. And so I was like, you're, it's an it's not going to be for you because you don't need to add anything else to it. And I think if you do add things to it, it's not, you know, it's not, doesn't taste right. Um, another way, not necessarily to introduce it to people that don't are on the keto lifestyle, but there are a lot of people that are in this bullet coffee lifestyle. That's for sure. And they're not, they don't, they're not on the keto lifestyle. So that's another way I got, I met strangers through hashtags that were like, whoa, hold on. You have a instant keto coffee in all of them. Um, that I sent samples to that tried it that are making bullet coffee at home. All of them said it's either as good or better. Um, so it's just a matter of sharing the thinking outside of the box that it's not, it's called keto coffee because in the long run, if you have that lifestyle, it will provide those things for you. Like it will help you burn fat. Like, are you going to drink coffee and burn fat in a day? No, you can tell people that, but that's not going to happen. Um, but it does help you with focus. It does give you good cholesterol, has many, many more benefits than other coffees do many. And it's less than $3 a cup. 
which go to Starbucks and get a coffee that's less than $3 a cup. I mean, I suppose you can get like some drip coffee, whatever, but no one gets that. I think um, early on was like the, the focus and the energy. Like I felt like I got so much done in a short amount of time. Like when I started using it, I was like, what is in this? Like, this is amazing. I Fairy think, dust. I think you're right on like the samples too, because there's a lot of, like rarely do I send samples of things other than maybe like the greens. Right. Like a lot of times you just need to give stuff some time. So I really kind of shy away from sending samples, but I agree with this. Like I've been sending samples of this like crazy because I think even the first time somebody tries it, they're going to, they notice that energy and they notice like, Oh my gosh, it's not a horrendous taste, you know? So I think like for me, the samples have been great for the keto coffee. I think that's good. Um, and I, when I sent samples too, I know a girl that, um, who is 110 fitness in Orange County, who just got certified and already has like a whole week of classes. She's like killer. Um, and so I asked her, she's like one of the few people I asked if they wanted to try it. Um, and she was like, dude, I should sell this at my gym. Yeah. I'm like, you should, um, because it keeps you full. Like, you know, she has classes all day where she's not eating. She doesn't want to eat because who wants to eat in between working out? Nobody. Um, so yeah, I, it's, it's definitely a good product. Um, it has a lot of good selling points. The price is a great selling point. The benefits are a good selling point. It's super rich and creamy, which I don't know many coffees that you can get in an instant that tastes like that. They always taste, there's always some funky taste to them. Um, and it mixes relatively easy. I think that better hot than cold, but I drink it cold. So perfect. Okay. I love it. Okay. Um, let's talk. Prebiotic. Let's talk about our probiotic, okay? Okay. Let's talk about um, the difference between a prebiotic and a probiotic. Why okay. they're both in our probiotic, and like, what is what is what are like the selling points of our probiotic? Because a lot of people will say, "Oh, I'm already on a probiotic," or mm -hmm. oh, like, you know, because there's a million different options on the market. Like, what is what are the key things that you would focus on when you're talking to people about why ours is so great? Because I think like for me, it's made a huge difference for me. Mm -hmm. Um, so let's talk about that. Me too. Um, and it wasn't one of the first products that I tried cause I was taking a probiotic. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I think I was trying to hit an 80 BV and I'm like, I need like 30 points people. I need 30. No, I needed like 31 and you can't get 31 with greens. Yeah. So I was like, yeah. <laughs> um, Okay, so the the probiotic and the prebiotic work together, uh, uh, and they generally a probiotic only works your large intestines, where the prebiotic works your small intestines and your large intestines. So if you think of uh, you think of the probiotic as it introduces good bacteria into your guts that you need. That good bacteria, um, one of the main things that it does is it helps move food through your guts. So that keeps you regular. That's like the obvious thing people know about probiotics. Um, so if that is that introducing the good, it's like the, the seed per se, right? It's like the, the good bacteria is like the seed. Well, then the prebiotic is fiber that it needs and the nutrition that it needs to then like, if you know, like the fertilizer per se, if you're growing something and you have a seed, it's going to be a lot better if you have a fertilizer. Um, so those things work hand in hand. Um, make sure I'm not missing anything. So why is, uh, ours, why is ours so much better? Or like what, what are the, like when someone's like, well, I'm already on one. Like what? Well, what okay. So the amount, the amount of um, live cultures that are in it are 10 billion, which is a lot. It's a lot, especially, um, I mean, that's the one I was taking had 3 million um, and I was still having okay, you know, um, effects from it, but the, the amount of life cultures is if people, the thing is that people don't, I mean, like, it's hard to talk to people about this cause they're like, Oh, okay, sure. Mm -hmm. Um, but I can, the easiest way to explain it or that I do is that, so it's got the 10 billion cultures in it and it's got a prebiotic and a probiotic. So it's cleaning out your whole digestive tract. So, um, not only is it keeping you regular, but 70% of your immune system is housed in your guts. Meaning if you have clean guts, it's really unlikely that you're going to get sick. And the combination of having the prebiotic and the probiotic together, it doesn't just help with digestive function. It will also help people that have IBS because it's, it's not just giving you good bacteria. It's having, it's like I said, it's like a fertilizer. So they're like working hand in hand. 
um, to really provide the um, rebalancing and restoring of your digestive tract that it needs. A prebiotic is good. It provides bacteria, but the probiotic with it, it's kind of like the whole shebang. It's like a two for one and it really is. Um, but I noticed that it also helps um, with like urinary tract infections. It's really good. And like, I know people probably don't want to talk about this stuff, but I mean, I know when I was pregnant that um, I had lots of like pH problems and like yeast problems. This all, those two things together, like it eliminates that. Like it's kind of like impossible for it to happen because the, that's, it's balancing you out, like in restoring you at the same time. Um, it also helps with, this is totally random, but it helps with eczema. And my mom is, um, is a living result of that. Um, she quit smoking and had terrible, terrible side effects from quitting smoking. Uh, she'd smoked for over 40 years and her body basically just couldn't get rid of the toxins. And if you don't know, your skin is your biggest cell. So um, it was, it, you know, basically excreting toxins through her skin. And so she got crazy, crazy eczema. And probiotics is one of the first things that she started taking because she's always had problems. Um, and she doesn't have eczema anymore. I mean, it was, she wouldn't even wear shorts. And my mom is, she looks like my sister. She's like five foot 10 and like super like in shape. So for her not to wear shorts, it was like, what? Um, so that's kind of a tough one to explain. Um, I did recently listen to um, like a NPR. That's right. We listen to radio talk radio at my house about how, and this is, you know, you can't really tell people this unless you're like your friends, but I did listen to a doctor saying that he was curious how many, so, so um, to see how can the over counter probiotics versus one from like it works or maybe subscribed or prescribed by a doctor or I know um, Luther, my boyfriend, he was buying things from um, a company online that's all natural based and it's, it's more for men. But anyway, they had a probiotic. But this doctor wanted to know how can they all be within such different price ranges but have similar ingredients? Um, and so he did the research and did the tests and stuff, and he found out that over half of drugstore uh, probiotics actually don't have in them what they say they do. So, and like I said, everyone's going to be like, oh, yeah, sure, that's just you talking. Um, so it, it's unlikely, without the prebiotic, like I said, it doesn't support your small intestines. And by supporting your small intestines and your large intestines, it's your whole digestive tract. So there's a small chance you're going to get sick small chance you're going to get a urinary tract infection, small chance you're not going to be able to go to the bathroom. Um, you know, they just work together. And other than that, I mean, I don't think there's really an easy way to explain it. The price isn't expensive. You don't have to refrigerate them. You don't want to swallow the pill. My mom mixes it in your smoothie. I mean, so, um, you can like open the capsule and sprinkle it and stuff. Yeah. Um, I know a lot of people will ask, will message me and say, Hey, I have an LC that's asking why our probiotic doesn't have to be refrigerated. And it's, because of the, it's in like the sealed blister pack. Class, right. right. The way it's, it's the way that it's packaged. Yeah. Okay. Um, but yeah, that's kind of a tough one because who wants to talk about pooping? I do. But, um, yeah, actually. <laughs> yeah. I mean, well, I have, I have a kid who that's her favorite word. Now I poop, I poop. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I think that it's, um, sometimes people like have doubt. I'm like, go search it. Google it. See what you can find. I mean, I don't know. I'm not, I, I, I'm seeking hashtag truth here, people. So that's my, that's my two cents on probiotics. Okay. All right. Let's talk about a, okay. Let's talk about what is a superfood. Okay. Let's talk about some of the superfoods that are in the greens that maybe are worth mentioning to like our potential customers or sure. like kind of like some things that are, kind of stick out to you as why our greens are so flipping amazing. So I think superfoods to me, um, in my opinion, and this isn't something that I like looked up or like wrote down. This is just my experience. Um, a superfood is are like a lot of them are things that you necessarily wouldn't think of eating. First of all, like sea algae and blue kelp. Um, uh, and like acai is a superfood. Um, but generally speaking, these, um, foods, they provide you with not only vitamins and nutrition, but they provide you with um, minerals, generally speaking, antioxidants. That's kind of what makes it a superfood. Um, and I wrote this down because I know that not everybody uh, 
I didn't want to say it wrong. Wait for it. I, I only have 67 pages of notes. <laughs> okay, so I wrote this down so that I could say that specifically. Um, so in antioxidant, because everyone says that, right? But no one's ever like, oh, yeah, what's that, you know? And I thought thinking about it, I don't really know how to describe that other than it like detoxes. But, I mean, that's kind of a general thing because there are so many superfoods that have antioxidants in it. Well, I found out that it actually um, – protects your body like in its blood like neutralizes and it doesn't allow you to get free radicals which is like kind of like um you know abnormal cells and blood that causes cancer so um there's a bigger picture to antioxidants so i think that has a lot to do with um things being called superfoods and maybe not realizing like what if it's really packed full of antioxidants what it does um yeah i think as far as that goes i mean I, I, I don't know. That, does that get enough answer? Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. So what are the things that stick out to you in the group? Okay. So first of all, let me tell all you people right now that I am an herb nerd. I don't ever get sick. My kid doesn't get sick. We lived, uh, I, her dad thinks I'm crazy, but he has Crohn's disease and only getting better because he lives my lifestyle. So um, I'm, I'm really into the power of herbs. So I'm not, I'm going to try not to geek out. I wrote down 10 of the like 50 plus so that I wouldn't geek out and you guys be like, I just blacked out. Like what happened? Um, so first of all, spirulina is the number one, like the, you know, the most ingredient in the, um, in the greens. And so that, that is like unicorn blood, unicorn milk. I don't even know how to describe it, but it's like super good for you. And the amount that's in our greens is unbeatable. It's unbeatable. You go look at any other greens, on the counter and it's like green cause it's got kiwi in it or like broccoli in it. But, um, spirulina is, it's amazing. It's, it, it has so many benefits. So, um, if you're wondering how, when they list off the things, uh, to the greens, how they can lower cholesterol and they can lower your blood sugar. I try to list the, the specific ingredients that kind of do that. So, cause some people are like, how, what, you know, so you can be like, Oh, cause it's got spirulina in it. Um, so that one particularly, it is um, a great source of amino acids. Uh, it has, it actually is a really good source of protein. Um, it improves digestion. It gives you energy. Um, it helps lower cholesterol. Let me see what I'm missing. Oh yeah, it actually, it's, it's full of antioxidants, so it purifies your blood. And it also helps purify your liver. Um, and then... Uh, it increases metabolism, which I didn't know that. I didn't know that. So maybe that's why the greens uh, help you, uh, give you energy as well as it can be used to um, burn more. Uh, I thought it was just from the matcha green tea. But so protein and uh, amino acids, I mean, that's like huge in itself. The immune boosting, having the, like being able to um, aid in digestion and be, have antioxidants in it. Like, I don't know any beef that can do that. Just in one ingredient. That's not right. That's one. That's one one ingredient. Um, so then, uh, turmeric is actually in it too, and it's actually not a large amount of turmeric. But you don't, if you're taking it daily, you don't need a lot of turmeric. Um, and turmeric is my, this is my jam, dude. I put that on everything, and I'm not even lying. Cuts, zits, you don't understand. Like it's 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 amazing. Um, it seriously is like you should, my dad was like, let me guess you put turmeric on it. I'm like, mm hmm. That's right. I did. Uh, so it's an antioxidant. It's actually like super, super, super antioxidant. That's why Indians like in India, they never die. They live to be forever because they eat turmeric every day on everything. They actually carry around little, little cans of spices that they put in their food with all their food. So they're never missing out. Um, but this one is really good for inflammation, really good for inflammation, like super good, whether it's inflammation of like you have like gut problems or like knee problems, shoulder problems, take and day. It's, it's really good for inflammation because um, it actually detoxes too and it helps the circulation. So it's going to help with the blood flow um, and help things not get like clogged and caught up and knotted. Um, it also helps. Um, this, I actually didn't know this until I did a little more research the other day that it says that it helps with cognitive function. So I'm like, that's why I'm so smart because I've been on the turmeric, uh, but no, for sure. Uh, but because it's an antioxidant and it helps with circulation, those two things, generally speaking, help with cholesterol and blood sugar because your, um, 
cholesterol is your blood pressure. And if your blood is flowing, it lowers your blood pressure and your blood sugar. If you're same kind of concept, if you got things flowing and your body is, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like regulating and maintaining a good blood sugar level, like breaking it down, breaking down the glucose, then it helps with your blood sugar. Okay. Um, there's also ginger root in it. Another super, super, super easy, great thing. Um, the main things that I, this is actually a lot of stuff, but from my experience, it's also really good for circulation, really good for circulation, which then helps with blood pressure. Um, it, it aids naturally aids in digestion. Like it works really well, really, really, really well. Um, and then, oh, that's it. Circulation, blood pressure, and um, digestion. Like you could just eat ginger and it would help with your stomach. Um, so there's, there's a few random ones at the very bottom, but they're like super, super powerful. Like meadow sweet. It's kind of an ancient herb plant that used to be used back in the day before traditional medicine, but it treated like ulcers, acid reflux, gout, microbial infections. So it's kind of like the antibiotic of plants. So I think that has a lot to do with why this boosts your immune because it kind of keeps things from, let's say, getting dirty, it keeps you clean in all aspects. Um, and then there's a uh, bilberry in it, which is also another, another great um, immune booster, but its main function is to support your digestion and like your, it, it kind of is like a diuretic where it flushes out and like keeps you regular. So because it does that, it generally helps with IBS. Okay. Um, like those things, like those last three things that you just talked about, like, do you think those are like some key, like for me, like the greens have, I mean, honestly, God, like, I feel like my IBS has been cured. You know what I mean? Like, I yeah. legit have no issues anymore, and it's been since I've been on the greens. I think that I tried to write down, so literally, like, 90% of my customers are on greens. My, my entire family is on greens. Um, and I don't, I don't mean, like, me and my boyfriend and my daughter. I mean, like, my aunts, my cousins, my mom, my dad, my sister, my brother-in-law, my brother, his girlfriend. Um, so I tried to take the results that they're having – since that's kind of like, it can be like a, um, uh, you know, like an overall, I suppose, or an average, mm -hmm. since there's like 70 of them, mm -hmm. um, and see what they're getting from it. Most, most of my family had um, stomach issues, so that's why I try to go through the, the ones that focus on that, because I think that the immune boosting, the detoxing, and the stomach, helping with stomach, um, which all goes hand in hand again, if your guts are clean and your guts are on track, then you're most likely not going to get sick. Yeah, so, like not only is my stomach been better, but I haven't been, I don't think I've been sick since I, like, I should, I mean, like it blows my mind. Like, yeah, Holly, my cousin on here can attest that I was like the sickliest child, like horrendously, like we could change my life, like legit have changed my life. And even my kids, you know, like my nine year old son for two years now hasn't touched an asthma inhaler or allergy medication, which was his life for the first eight years of his life. I mean, like that speaks volumes to me. Like, unreal. yeah, but I always am like, what in it is actually making this happen? Um, so you know, everybody talks about they don't have allergies with it. Um, so I, I don't really know why other than, other than it's full of antioxidants mm -hmm. and amino acids that, you know, and that helps rebuild cells. So um, that's one thing I can think of. And like, you know, there are certain things that help with, there are a handful of things to help with circulation and inflammation. So that could go hand in hand with like your sinuses being inflamed. Um, you know, and if you have breathing problems, that could all go back to circulation problems and not getting the correct blood flow to your heart or your lungs. Um, I mean, I'm not a doctor by any means, but um, generally speaking, that makes sense to me. Okay. That's crazy. Okay. Um. Let's move on. What is, tell us um, about what bioavailable actually means. Okay. So that just, um, generally speaking, my easiest way to explain that is um, having a group of things that work together so that your body can really absorb them and use them. Um, like if your doctor tells you that you need calcium, 98.999% of doctors are going to tell you you need vitamin D as well so that your body can absorb it. So that's kind of why. Some of the things are like, okay, so you get like 12 servings or 15 servings of fruits and vegetables, but there's 50 fruits and vegetables, 40 fruits and vegetables. That's because some of them work hand in hand so that your body can absorb them and get the full nutrients from them. 
So that's what bioavailable means. It means that there's a blend of products or minerals or herbs or fruits that um, work hand in hand so that your body can absorb them and get the full benefits from them. So that's why we say like with hair, skin, and nails, because I hear that a lot with hair, skin, and nails, like they're, it's filler free with all bioavailable ingredients so that your body can use it fully and quickly, right? And yeah. Like there are some minerals in hair, skin, and nails that when I got to reading it that I'm like, this doesn't have, I can't think of what it has to do with hair, skin, and nails, but then you get to reading that this mineral goes with this botanical thing so that your body can absorb it okay. or break it down or break it down. Like, doesn't this like seriously make you like really, um, admire this company even more like how yeah they put into like researching what will make this work for you like that just it's just nuts to me like I it just makes me love it even more well and they're using products like I tried so I have some people that are skeptics and usually I'm I'm kind of the person where like if you want to do something you're going to do it so I'm going to provide you the tools if you don't want to use them then yeah I'm probably not going to stand behind you and tell you how um, so I just, I tell people like you go, you go and search, tell me where you get these, 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 um, ingredients somewhere else in one, in one packet, you, you go, you go look and then get back to me because that's the only, I mean, that you can preach and you can talk all day, but until someone believes it in themselves or, you know, wants to believe it, they're not going to. And, uh, Holly, where's your dog? Where's Moose? That's right. You'll get them. <laughs> okay. Um, so when something says uh, a proprietary blend, what does that um, mean? So that's just a fancy way of saying um, it's like secret ingredients. And as uh, anything, you have to list the ingredients. But when it's a proprietary blend, you don't have to list the amount of the ingredients, just what the ingredients are, because it's a, it's a blend. Um, so it's just basically, in short, like our secret blend of um, ingredients, uh, letting you know what's in it. But then you don't know the amounts so that nobody can copy it. It's kind of like copywriting your, your ingredients. So like with our wraps, we don't want anyone else to come up with our wraps. So we're going to like say what's in it, but not how much of anything is in it because we don't want anyone to copy that. Right. I think sometimes people take that as, I know I've had a couple people like potential loyal customers be like, well, it says proprietary blend. I'm like, well, everything's right there. You know, how much, how much it is, but that makes perfect sense. Like and anybody and their mother could copy what we have if mm -hmm. how much of every single thing was in it. Okay good to know okay let's talk about confianza and versus new you so okay i know that new you um has done wonders for so many people in my life for their sleep quality but i also know that confianza is used as as a good kind of sleep aid too um which i really didn't know too much until recently because i i just take that kind of when i need it when i'm feeling super stressed but I never thought of it as something that might help me with sleep. So tell us about what's the difference and who would you recommend which one? Okay. Um, so, sorry, I, I closed, I was, I was fidgeting. I saw like something on the bottom flashing. I'm like, oh, I got to get rid of that. I can't have a flashing thing. Um, okay. So we know that Confianza is used for stress. Um, and I wrote down a lot of stuff because I feel like, I, it doesn't have very many ingredients in it, so um, it's kind of easy to explain. But in short, so um, Confianza, it, uh, it regulates your cortisol and it regulates your, uh, it balances your hormones. So um, a lot of people, okay, so when, I don't know, the easiest way for me to explain this is that, like, let's say... Like my sister had to have a hysterectomy and she had really bad effects from like hormonal problems, right? You have a baby, you have effects from hormonal problems. So if something's helping you balance your hormones, it's probably going to make you happier or elevate your mood per se. So, um, so that, you know, it helps you elevate your mood by regulating cortisol and balancing your hormones. Um, my my daughter is in the other room with her buddy and I can hear her. She's mom, mom, mom. <laughs> I'm in here. Um, let's see. So there is, um, there's a, there's a thing called, it's an Indian root. Actually it's called puncture vine, but it is one of the main ingredients and it actually helps um, 
lower blood pressure, and it helps you with fatigue and restoring natural energy. So now we've got regulating hormones, keeping you with energy, and keeping you from getting tired. Okay. okay. Moving right along. Golden root extract is one of the ingredients. It's a Siberian, uh, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's an ancient root and it, um, it's, it's packed full of antioxidants. So there you go again. It's like helping your immune system. It's keeping your blood clean. It's helping you from fighting free radicals. So it's kind of boosting your immune and without going into like too much detail, if you, um, I struggled from a car accident for years ago and I had major pain problems and I refused to have surgery and I refused to take pain pills because of what the options were. So I finally got a doctor that explained to me, when you have a weak immune system, that affects your nervous system, that affects your brain. All of them eventually go into shock. All eventually they're like, what's going on? So if you're in pain and you have nerve problems, same thing, that affects your immune system, that affects your brain. If you are sad or you have lots of stress, that affects your nerves, that affects your immune system. So having the antioxidants in it, that is another way that it's just helping you um, kind of stay like tip top, I suppose. Um, and then it's got um, the, the, the regular name of it is some weird long name, but it's actually called Horny's Goat Weed and you can get it anywhere. But that really helps with improving your cognitive function. It actually works in a part of your brain to help you stay focused. Um, okay, so now we have, it helps you eliminate, like not resist stress, right? Helps you lower your blood pressure. It helps you, what else did we say? Balance hormones, gives you energy and fight fatigue. So if you're if your mind is right and your body is right and you're not stressed, you're probably going to sleep better. That's the one thing I notice with Compienza because um, I'm pretty laid back and not a lot bothers me, or at least I don't, you know, I'm like, oh, whatever. It's not, it's out of my hands. Um, since being a mom, i sometimes I feel like there's not enough time in the day and I have to realize that table doesn't have to get dusted. Okay. I can dust the table tomorrow. So I do notice that that helps me like kind of realize like, you know, not sweat the small things. But for me, I notice that I sleep. I don't, I never wake up ever. I mean, if Lily wakes up, yes, but I don't wake up. Um, and I have four people that are on it and they all take it for sleeping. So if, if you're looking for kind of an uplifting I think a really good way to explain it is just I tell my sister, my sister's like, why do you have to take that? You're not stressed out. I don't know why you're taking that. I'm like, well, you know what? I'm just trying to be the best me that I can be. I got a lot on my plate. I want to be the best me that I can be. And I don't want to have, um, cause I don't have anxiety. You know, I don't, I'm not like depressed, but everyday things happen, right? Everyday thing happens. So I, I think that this helps me be the best me. And for this kid getting sleep, that's me being the best me for sure. If I'm hungry or tired, it's really the only reasons I'm mad. <laughs> okay, so the new you. Oh, somebody okay. Just, somebody just asked, Sorry. Somebody just asked if you, like, what time of day that you take your confianza. First thing in the morning with my breakfast. If I don't eat breakfast, I'm throwing a banana in my purse and I'm taking it. Yeah, because it's two pills a day. And it's a blend of, um, you know, it's only, it's only a, a few items or whatever, but the, I don't know that it's per se time released, but the sooner you take it, the sooner it's going to get working. And you want that because, um, you know, mornings are hectic. Traffic is hectic. Work is hectic. So um, first thing in the morning. If somebody's taking it specifically for sleep, do you still feel like morning is the best time to take it? I take it in the morning. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm not like blacking out or napping during the day. Okay. How about new you? Okay. New you, um, is a little different. So the general uh, focus on new you is, and I wrote so much down, but I'll try to keep it short because it's, it's a lot of amino acids, first of all. So they're all like L pine, tryptopine, na, 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 na. And you're like, what? Nobody wants to know that. Um, so it provides, uh, vitamins, minerals, and nutrients to you, like the, a blend of it, of some of the stuff does. It also has a lot of amino acids and antioxidants in it, um, which I don't know if you know, amino acids are like the building blocks to restore things. Um, so it, um, it's got antioxidants and it helps inflammation. So it's actually good for people that work out. Um, anybody that I know that works out that's older, whether it's male or female, um, I suggest this to them because as you get older, your body quits making testosterone. 
Um, and so I know men want that and need that um, as they get older. So this, this helps for, it helps with sleeping in general. I'll get to that. But for specifically, it helps for people that are active because it's like, it's really good for post-workout recovery. It helps with inflammation. It's got antioxidants in it. Um, it's going to help your body not get so beat up. It's going to protect it, I should say. Um, and then wait for it. I'm just making sure I covered everything. So one of the amino acids particularly is uh, it stimulates your body to produce and release its own HGH, which is the hormone uh, growth hormone. Um. Now, how does it help you sleep? Because it's got uh, GABA, G-A-B-A -A in it, and that is a neurotransmitter that actually dampens your nervous system. So it actually helps you calm down, makes your, your nerves kind of mer. And so having the good sleep with the, um, the uh, stimulating of the HGH, you excrete most of your HGH in REM sleep. So as you're sleeping is, is generally when your body produces and releases uh, HGH. So if you're getting better sleep, <laughs> if you're getting better sleep, then you are more likely to, you know, release and produce on the, on your own, which, um, like I know for Luther, my boyfriend, um, he's got Crohn's disease really bad. And so I finally got him taking this poor kid takes a lot of stuff. So I know he doesn't want to add to it, but I talked him into taking it because I heard a success story with someone that has the, had something similar to him. Um, so he's only been taking it for like a week. Um, but I hope to have a good success story from it, um, uh, because he, his body, doesn't absorb nutrition well because he has Crohn's and it basically is like it just doesn't work. He doesn't get a lot of the nutrients and you know, like he can eat a cheeseburger. He's probably actually getting a quarter of it. I mean, we don't eat cheeseburgers, but hypothetically speaking. Holly, that would so be really we're good. what? Holly, I said that would be really good for her to take because she does. Um. So hopefully, him helping him get sleep and him being able to get his own because I mean I don't know if you know this, but like. Magic Johnson and like um, people that have really, really, really bad, um, you know, illnesses, they take HGH, like they get HGH shots because their body doesn't produce enough and it helps you um, immensely. So if you can help restore that on your own, then it's really beneficial for your body. That's why it's called New You. Okay. Well, and I hear like a lot of the, um, I've even heard, I mean, like I was at a, in a meeting one time with Pam Powder and she was talking about the products she loves or whatever. And she said, if you are not on new you, you need to get on it today. She said there, it is absolutely probably one of the best products that we have. And one that we don't talk about enough that like the difference that it can make in your life. Yeah. It's hard to explain. I think that it's definitely hard to explain. The ingredients are a little complex. Um, but it's, um, if you, like I said, you know, just to recap, because I know I talk fast, sorry. Um, so it's got the amino acids in it, helps inflammation, antioxidants. It's got the, um, the particular amino acid, because it has multiple amino acids in it, that helps you uh, produce and release HGH. And then um, the GABA, the G-A-B-A, is the neurotransmitter that dampens your nervous system that allows you to get better REM sleep, REM sleep. And then you uh, produce and release HGH in that time. That's amazing. How cool is that? I think a lot of people think of new you as like just a men's supplement. Cause you think like, no, you know, whatever. Like, I feel like a lot of people just think, Oh, that's just for guys, but that's not the case. No, I can't remember her name. Who's the lady. Who did the Zoom with Kelsey, the, like the amazing Zoom? Cindy? No, I don't know her name. She just went on the, um, she just went on Surf and Turf. Siddle, oh, I don't know her name. Gosh, you know who she is. You were on that call. Terry Lynn Alcala? Nope. She's older. She's been in network sales forever. Kim, oh, Kim Satter. Kim Satter. Yes, Kim. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. She said, she said, knew you, gotta have it. That's her go-to. Well, hey. So that's why I started looking into it more because I don't really, I didn't recommend it to a lot of people, but I've recently had some people that have um, health issues and need, um, need uh, nutrients in their life. 
of especially people that have gone, they're going through cancer or recovering from cancer and can't eat yet. So I suggest the Profit and um, then uh, I also suggest New You to them because being able to, like I said, um, have your HGH release itself is beneficial. That's awesome. Like I never knew that. Like I have, that's awesome. Okay, perfect. Okay, let's talk about, um, okay, so I know that you've had customers have a lot of success with like as far as kind of um, blood sugar and di diabetes and with like fat fighters and so yep. let's, let's talk about Thermofit fat fighters. Okay. Um, to go to my notes so I don't blab. Um, okay. So first let's talk about Thermofit. And now don't get me wrong. These things can go hand in hand and anybody can use them. I find for me, um, there's moose. There he is. He's a good puppy. Oh my gosh. All the kisses. All the kisses. Sorry. I love dogs. Um, I find that if you find a product, if you, if you really get to find out my kids screaming in the background, like death curdling screaming. Um, if you find out what your what the person that you're helping with helping really needs, like maybe it's weight, but why? Why is it weight? You know, and I could, that's a whole another Zoom probably. But um, so that's what started me with the um, Fat Fighters versus Thermofit. They can be used together, absolutely. Um, for me, I, I think that it's a complete lifestyle change for things to really work. Um, and I know not everybody wants that, but for me personally, that's what I suggest to people. So I try to find out what they really need help with, not just losing weight. Usually losing weight, there's an underlying factor to that four out of five times. So Thermofit is, um, has a small blend. It's, you know, it's another pretty simple product. Um, so I explain it to people because I think when you say energy, people instantly think like bad. They, oh, I don't, you know what I mean? They don't, they don't think good. They think like, um, like monster or those caffeine pills you buy at the gas station or whatever. Um, so Thermofit has dandelion root in it, which I kind of went over a little bit earlier. It's a diuretic. So it flushes out your, um, your kidneys and your, um, your digestive tract. It just, it flushes you out. It keeps you from retaining excess water. Um, has acai in it, which is a super, super, super food. It's full of antioxidants. Um, so that, uh, again, if you're, if you're feeling good, your brain's going to feel good. You're, it's just going to work hand in hand. So it's full of antioxidants. Um, let me make sure I didn't get anything else. Okay. And then it's got the, um, the pepper bin, the capsicum. I always just say pepper blend because like some, some words that I can't say, I'm like, people aren't going to listen to me if I can't say what it, I can't say it. So I say pepper blend. Um, so that aids in suppressing your, your um, getting hungry. You know, it helps you from suppressing and curbing your appetite. Uh, it also helps break down fat and increases your metabol uh, metabolism. So I also found out that it's high in vitamin C and this is new to me. So I have to read it verbatim. So for your body to metabolize fat, you need lots of vitamin C. I never knew that. So that's how it works. That's how it works so well because all the peppers that are in it are packed full of vitamin C. Hmm. There you go. Now you know. It also has gymnema in it, which is, uh, it's, they call it a folk herb, but it's used in India and Asia, the Philippines specifically. It's used by itself to treat diabetes. Yeah, so it regulates and maintains blood sugar uh, on its own. It's just an herb that does that. It just helps break down glucose. Um, and then uh, it's got chromium in it, which is also aids in uh, regulating blood sugar and um, your metabol. It, it helps keep your um, metabolic rate up. Uh, and then it has the green tea in it for natural energy and also helps metabolism. So people, when you talk about the... Um, the green tea of the energy. So it's a non jittery energy. That's why I took Thermofit. I really liked it. I'm not a caffeine person. Um, and it's, it's like the least addictive drink caffeine. Like you don't get, you don't have to have more of it. Like my mom drinks. Okay. Maybe she's on here. I'm not gonna say that. Like my mom doesn't drink anything. She's perfect. Like but I know lots of people that drink lots of soda throughout the day. I'll just say that. So um, it's not going to like give you a headache when you come off of it. Right. And it's, and it really is like energy. It's not, um, like coffee doesn't really do that for me. I mean, keto coffee does, but just coffee. So it's different. It's a different kind of energy. 
So I recommend this to people that are active, that have a busy health, health like a busy lifestyle, um, that they want to meet workout goals. They want to have energy to either get up in the morning and do it. They want to have, hi. They want to have, uh, for me, it was energy. I started working out at nighttime, and I needed that thermo fit with my dinner to give me that energy when everybody else was sleeping in the house. Um, and also, so I recommend this to people that have like a busy work lifestyle. Maybe you're on your feet all the time um, because if you're constantly walking around on your feet, this helps you burn more calories on its own. So if you're going to burn 100 calories, we're going to burn 300 calories. So um, like I said, you can recommend it to anybody. It helps you with energy and helps with metabolism. Um, but I think people that are active and that are working out, they see the best results from this. Okay. Now, fat fighters. Fat fighters are amazing for people that have, I just did a live on this and I, I didn't realize I talked forever. It was such a long life. I'm like, Oh God, people probably were like, get off, stop talking. Um, so they work really well for uh, people with diabetes. I have two people that, um, are type two diabetes that are using them. Um, I'm also a chef and certified in nutrition. So I actually help them with meals and like meal planning and cutting out bad foods and healthy alternatives. Um, because with diabetes, you kind of have to do that. But this, this product on its own has so many minerals and fruits and herbs in it that naturally help with blood sugar, that it by itself really helps people with their blood sugar. So um, in addition to, it has chromium, which we just went over. It helps with their meta uh, metabolic rate and uh, regulating blood sugar. But it's got the cactus leaf in it, and that's how it, um, that's how it fights fat. It's a source of fiber and it literally like pulls the fat and doesn't let your body absorb it or digest it. Um, so because it's dietary fiber, it also will help you keep you regular and keep things from staying in your guts. Um, it has the, uh, I don't even know, banamba, banaba leaf in it. Um, that's another thing in Asia they use for diabetes by itself, like by itself. Um, so it actually, the, the leaf itself has a, what is it? It's a corosolic acid in it, which I'm, I'm sure nobody wants to know that, but it actually decreases insulin in your pancreas. So it regulates and lowers your blood sugar naturally. Um, so your diabetic, and if, your diabetic customers, you're, you're recommending thermofit and fat fighters. Well, um, so, you know, a lot of people that want this lifestyle change don't necessarily have $70 a month. So um, for me, if somebody has problems with diabetes and are looking to lose weight, I recommend Fat Fighters to begin with. Okay. Um, Dr. Dawn said so too, and that's what made me start researching this more because I thought Thermofit would be better. But um, and I'm I don't know I don't know about everybody, but the people that I'm helping with are not currently active. They do not have an active lifestyle, and they're looking for something just to help get their blood sugar down. And um, both of them also have problems with their, uh, like, bowels, and this is helping them. Um, it does give them energy, they said, and it does kind of suppress their appetite a little bit. Um, but I'm trying to get them from eating bad to eating good. So that's why I'm giving them this, because they both currently don't eat well. So, um, like, me using it as, like, a cheat meal, they're, like, you know, they could use it twice a day really, because they have high blood sugar and they don't eat well. I mean, they're eating better. They're both on month two. Um, it's so it's got, awesome. what? So then you said it's already helping them both, which is awesome, right? Yeah, no, it ha within the first week, they both, because, you know, they test their blood. Both of them had much lower, um, you know, like it was over 150 and now it's like 98. Their glucose levels. Um, and then it has the... Uh, Garcinia cambogia in it. I'm probably saying that wrong. Um, but that's a super fruit from India and Asia. It's, um, it helps reduce cravings, particularly sugar. Um, and it's another one that helps with cholesterol and uh, blood sugar. And let's see here. So talking about now you're like, okay, so it helps with blood sugar, but what else? Okay. So when you, when your blood sugar level is high and your glucose level is high, your body can only break down so much sugar, so many carbs per day. So if you have backup of sugars, it's going to turn into fat 
way faster than you're going to be able to burn it, especially if your body can't break it down to begin with. So that's how this helps with weight loss. Not only does it keep you from, you know, actually absorbing the fat, but by regulating your blood sugar and maintaining a healthy cholesterol, your body is going to start losing weight because it's not retaining the sugar anymore. Um, because once your body can't break down sugar, eventually it will turn into water. And then you're just having excess water. Which is kind of the basis of this whole keto craze right now too, right? Right. Cool. Yeah. That's so yeah, like I said, I recommend this to people that want, that are looking for a healthy lifestyle. I think that it's definitely an easy alternative. People that don't eat well, um, and then um, anyone that has diabetes or like for me, um, you know, like right now it's the season like where I don't, I want to eat. I'm a baker anyway. So there's always bacon to my house. Um, I don't really eat them that often. Try not to. But I want to eat pumpkin pie right now. I want gravy on everything. And I want 17 tablespoons of butter in my baked potato every day. So um, I'm glad that I have fat fighters because I don't feel so guilty about working out six days a week. And then I'm like, oh, but I just ate half a stick of butter and it wasn't grass fed. Okay, I have one more question for you. Sure. Um, let's talk ProFit versus Shake. Okay. Who's the best for who? Okay, so um, a lot of people are lactose intolerant, and I don't know if you know, but whey is a derivative of milk. It's like the fat from milk, um, so or where the protein is stored. So the ProFit has, uh, it's you know, I mean not ProFit, pardon me. The the Shake is soy and whey free. So um, then of course it's, it's gluten free, it's vegan, it's, you know, dairy free, it's non-GMO, it's organic. So it's basically allergen free. So it's usually anybody can stomach it where whey, like I know Luther, my boyfriend, he can't do whey protein. Um, my mom uh, or my, my aunt can't do it. My cousin Tasha is on it now. She can't do whey, but they all have success with this. The thing with the, um, our, uh, our, our, our vegan shake is that, so a few things to explain. Cause like when people read the, um, the pamphlet of like what it does and like how it works, it says that it, uh, suppresses your appetite and people are, uh, for me, I wanted to know like why, you know? So it's literally comprised of complex uh, peptide chains, meaning the amino acid blend that's in it and the ingredients that are in it. It's a complex blend of ingredients. So it literally takes your body longer to break down. Therefore, you don't get hungry. Okay. Um, the, uh, I'm not like, I had never actually drank a protein shake before this. I'm not going to lie. They were chalky and I was like, nah, I'm good. I like food. Um, but I've been drinking it for months and I told Jess this and I can tell we're all friends here, right? I swear after having a baby, I lost so much muscle and I was in the best shape of my life before I got pregnant. Um, but my like butt and my thigh, they're separate entities now. Like it's no longer like one object. They're separate. That's right. I have a butt and a thigh and it's only since I've been taking, um, this protein cause I haven't changed my workout. So I'm just like, that's what's up people. Do you want a butt? You want your butt back? Cause I did. And I got it. Um, but so I'm not, I'm not big into the BCAA, but I did a product call with, uh, Michael Bilyeu, who is into all that. And, um, he, he, he talks to the doctors that created this and there are lots of vegan proteins out there, but the array of, um, amino acids that are in this there, he says, and I'll take his word for it, right. That there's not any other ones out there. So, um, same thing with, you know, bioavailable different amino acids work together to help you uh, restore, rebuild, create muscle. So the blend of amino acids that's in this is really top notch. Um, sorry, my nose is just, oh, cause they have cats where I'm at, they have cats. And then lastly, from the yellow, uh, the, the pea protein and the sprouted brown rice, um, it actually gives you um, quite a few um, vitamins in it. So it also is, supports a healthy uh, cholesterol and heart. And it regulates blood sugar. It's a good source of fiber as well. Okay. Uh, I think it's really cool that you can cook with it. I think that it's versatile. Like for me, I don't want to use a blender. I'm not, I don't need to wash any more dishes. So I'm just mix it with almond milk. I'm out the dough. I like that about that. I don't have to add anything else to it. Um, I also make pancakes with it. Uh, I also make uh, like nice cream. So like strawberries, coconut milk, protein. Um, and then uh, I did some... I'm not really like protein 
I guess it was kind of like a protein ball to like snack on. Um, I didn't eat those fast enough though, but they were good. Um, I just don't really snack that much anymore. Now that I'm on my protein, I don't need to snack. And then ProFit. Okay, so this is really good. Like for my mom, she, and I talked about my mom. I love her. She's got so many amazing, amazing stories. She started, she started distributing because she had so many amazing stories. She's like, I want to tell the world. I need to tell everybody because her doctors told her that she had an autoimmune disease. They couldn't find out what it was. They're like, oh, maybe it's hepatitis. Hepatitis? What? She started taking greens, probiotics, and profit for three months. After three months, gone. Miraculously gone. Doctors were like, well, I don't know what happened. Wow. Yeah, talk about that. Not to mention, like, eczema. Her IBS is gone. So, like, my mom's got lots of great stories. Long story short, she works a crazy lifestyle, um, like, weird hours. So she wanted something that provided her more nutrients than just protein. So she got on the ProFit. So even though ProFit has whey and soy in it, they're both organic, non-GMO, um, and they are ultra filtered whey, which that means it's already been broken down so that your body can easily absorb it because whey is typically hard to absorb. So ours is ultra filtered, which means your body can absorb it and uh, take it in much easier because it's already been broken down for you. Okay. Um, it also has a uh, maca in it, which is a root. And it actually has more calcium than milk, a lot more calcium in it. In, its, in maca in itself, it's got over 20 amino acids. So it, in addition to the amino acids from the protein, the maca is full of amino acids as well. Um, it talks about how it helps elevate your mood. It's because the maca root is used in Asian countries um, it's actually used to uh, for like depression and anxiety because it's a natural way to balance your hormones. Hmm. Um, it has the cacao in it, which is the rawest form of cocoa. Um, and it's packed full of antioxidants, loaded, 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 full of antioxidants. So that hand in hand with balancing the hormones has is another reason why it's like uplifting per se. And then uh, the cacao is also an excellent source of fiber. Um, so it helps, you know, regulate yourself and, uh, it helps, um, maybe that's why people that my mom didn't used to be able to drink milk or halfway, but she can take this because the cacao helps move things through helps, you know, it's a dietary fiber. Um, I think that's, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, I did, I did, I did learn that this one particularly promotes faster workout recovery where I didn't hear that about the other one. So if somebody is, um, into workout, into working out more, um, and like my mom is older and has problems and, um, her, her, her um, husband is same thing, works weird hours on his feet all the time, works in a warehouse. He says that he doesn't have, he doesn't have aches anymore. He doesn't take greens or anything else. He just drinks the protein before work. Um, but he said that crazy, he doesn't eat candy anymore. And this is the only thing he's changed in his life. He hasn't done anything else. He doesn't have candy. He doesn't want candy anymore. It's great. It's keeping that him from doing that. Um, he doesn't get tired and he, uh, he doesn't drink soda anymore. So something in there is working for him to not have sugar cravings. So he doesn't take greens and he doesn't do the probiotic or anything. Um, Krista just asked, why did you choose ProFit for your mom rather than the shake? What were your... Because um, the ProFit is a nutritional protein. So it's actually got, a you know, that bioavailable blend of uh, fruits and vegetables in it that the regular shake doesn't have. Um, and the maca and the cacao there, if you look them up, like they're, sup they're super foods on their own. And I knew that my mom needed... Um, she needed those, uh, like that extra boost of antioxidants to help her with her health, but more so, um, some of the ingredients in this are similar to the greens. I mean, on a small scale. Mm -hmm. So, um, it's providing her extra nutrients, uh, in minerals and vitamins that you don't get from the, uh, regular protein, uh, on a, and, and a larger amount, I should say. That makes sense. Okay. Oh my gosh. I love it. Does anyone else have any questions? Taking a picture. Yay! <laughs> I love it. This has been so helpful. Because I, like, I honestly, like, I know, you know, like, I, I you know, I have my, I, my thing down. When someone asks me a question about a product, like, this is this, this, and this, and this, and this. 
But often in my head, I'm thinking like, but why? Like, I don't know why. Like for me with like my gut issues and stuff, I'm like, yes, I know it's the greens, but why? So this has yeah. been really, really, really helpful. Like, I love it. I love and it. And not everybody wants it. I get that. Not everybody wants all the information, but I found, like I said, um, for me, uh, building my business and keeping customers, um, when you find something that really helps them, like my aunt um, kind of went through a slump and gained a lot of weight, wasn't taking care of herself, wasn't eating healthy, and she um, started on ThermoFit, uh, started on, what else, greens, Confianza, and wraps, all like all out the door. That's what she started on. So she's had great results for that. She uh, now takes the protein and has her own energy from the protein. So she doesn't have to take ThermoFit anymore. So now she takes Fat Fighters to help. You know, she doesn't have to take them every day because she's not eating bad, but she still wants something to help her with the metabolism and sugars. Um, so I think that if you spend the extra time, um, and I know that some people have a lot of customers and it's not always feasible, but if for people that really want a lifestyle change, if you just kind of get to the root of what the problem is, knowing how the products work and what they really do will help them. And I, like I said, I find, um, I haven't lost any customers yet. Wow. I mean, that's so, absolutely incredible. Did you think about, you know, people like talking about retention, like how to keep customers past that three months? Well, I think you just hit the nail on the head. Get to know their story, get to know their goals. You know, maybe their goals are yeah. better, but why? You know, maybe I just, I think that's so key because this business is about the people. It is about helping people, making feel people feel better. Um, and I think you hit the nail right on the head with that. You just got to get more, you just got to kind of get down and dirty with what their, what their goals are and what their health history is. Um, well, and share success stories. I really think that helps a lot. I think that letting them know someone else is in their boat makes them open up to be like, man, you know, like some of the things that were wrong, but my, my problems that my mom was having, she didn't necessarily know that she was having. Like for me, I didn't realize I wasn't eating to the best potential that I was that and that's why I didn't have energy. So the thermo fit kind of put me on a plan um, to give me more energy. And then once I got to thinking about, okay, I need to change other things in my life to this, you know, for longevity purposes, um, it made me realize that, oh, okay, well, you know, I, I'm not like being true to myself and that's a huge step for health people, people with health problems. Um, it's acknowledging that you have the problem and sometimes it's not there. I mean, like for me, I didn't know it at first. I didn't see what was going on. Um, but I've, I've been finding that most people, they want someone to talk to it about and they don't want to talk to a doctor. They don't want to be a number. You know, they don't want to be a patient that sits in a room for 45 minutes and you get poked and probed and your number and, you know, I don't know. So, um, so often, even, even if you have customers that come to you that aren't happy with the results or aren't, you know, I feel like so more often than not, it's just that they were misinformed. Um, and they had, you know, expectations that weren't realistic or just honestly, like they, um, I think for you, you know, like helping them you know, let's take out what we're doing that maybe it could help, you know, maybe it's the diet, you know, if they're on ThermoFit or Fat Fighters or whatever, but they're still eating horribly, you know, let's mm -hmm. help them with some, with some better choices. And I think most people would be open to hearing that. They just need someone to take the time to help kind of educate them on how yeah. the results that they're looking for. To care. Yeah. Yeah. And so anybody on here, you tell anyone on your team, whatever. I mean, I definitely don't have time to meal plan for anyone. But um, I know that my cousin doesn't really eat that bad and she has a family to feed and she has to stay within a budget. Um, but she's been asking me, okay, so I'm going to make this and it has this in it. Can I use something instead to make it better? Um, so if anybody ever on, you know, the anybody on our team wants to know, I don't know, needs help with food, you, your customers, whatever. I mean, you can always shoot me a message. Um, generally speaking, it's probably something I've helped with someone else. I mean, I've been doing this for a long time, so I probably have something saved in my phone. I remember Holly wanted some soup recipes when I was in Indiana and my, my aunt was like, where, how are you going to do that? I'm like, I got them in my notebook. <laughs> um, so yeah, I don't know. I'm happy to help anyone that wants the help. Um, that's kind of my like nature. I'm, um, I'm super to the point and a matter of fact, but, um, I know that it's not easy these days. I know that the struggle is real, eating out, uh, not being healthy, not necessarily controlling what you eat. Um, so a few changes can help things, especially if you're taking the supplements. I can guarantee you your customers are going to have better results if um, they make other lifestyle changes. And not everybody wants that. Don't get me wrong. But it definitely helps. Perfect. 
I love it. Thank you so much for your time tonight. I yeah, of course. This is super great, super helpful. We love you and we appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thanks, everybody. Bye, guys. Bye, Holly. Bye. You guys have a great night.